how to create a payment link on Square. Hello everyone and welcome back. In today's video, I'll be showing you guys how you can create a payment link on Square. So let's get started. Now, before we create our own payment link, we need to understand what payment links are. So payment links are essentially a simpler form of invoicing. It allows you to set a link out to any person that is purchasing products or services from you and they can directly pay via that particular link so they open that link up and it leads them to a checkout and they can directly check out as if they had been shopping online this makes it really easy for you to keep track of all of your finances and receive payments really quickly and easily and with Square's infrastructure, it ensures that everything remains really private and your security for your payments is maintained. So let's get started with creating our link. For this, simply head on over to squareapp.com. Once you do that, you are going to go into products on the top menu bar and you will see on the bottom left, it says payment links. Click on payment links over here. And once you click on payment links, you will see this is the square payment links, simple, powerful payments. So you're going to click on get started over here to proceed with your account on square. So over here, you're going to enter your email address and then you are going to create a suitable password, agree to their terms of service and click on continue. Now I have you know, created my account previously, so I'm going to just sign in over here. And once we have signed up or signed in to our Square account, we can proceed on to the next step, which is our Square dashboard and where we're going to set up our Square payment links. So on the left, you have your online section in Square Online where you can manage your retail section. You also have different products. You have items and orders, reporting tools, sales channels, staff and payroll, payments, marketing and loyalty, banking, POS systems, and more. So you have a lot of different sections within your dashboard and you can actually utilize a lot of these things to your advantage. A lot of people do skip out on these features, but I do think that you can easily use all of these features to further boost your business. If you are looking to create just payment links, you can simply proceed on to your sales channels and you will see your online sales channels and online. Square Online is where you can set up your Square site to sell products, but below that you have a payment section. And in your payment section, you have bill payments, invoicing, payment links. So you're going to click on payments on the left, then click on payment links. Once you click on payment links, you will see over here, you can choose the purpose of your payment link. So if you are accepting donations via this payment link, if you're selling a class or an event, then if you're just selling a product via a link or just accepting payments. So Taking a payment, if these are direct payment links that you're going to send out to your individual customers, let's say I have a supplier or let's say I have a product purchaser that purchases, you know, bulk products from me and I just need to send them out a payment link to, you know, get my most recent payment, I can just send out a link. This is the direct method. And this is usually catered to each individual business or person that you're sending this out to. Selling the item can be an easier option because this allows you for customization of how your payment link is going to function, how many units they are buying and how they're going to receive it. Then you have your event or class or donations. Now I am going to be creating a direct payment because usually when it comes to payment links, that is the purpose. And I'm just gonna click on continue. Then on the left, you will have to add the details. So this is going to be our, let's say I am supplying someone with honey supply payments or yeah, let's say it's honey supply. Then you have two options. Either they can pay any amount or an exact amount. So let's say they have to pay us exactly a thousand dollars. 
And then after that, you can also set up frequencies. So if you are in business with someone and you have recurring payments, it's really difficult to send out links every time the payment is due. So you can automate this process by setting up a frequency. Let's say they have to pay us monthly, so $1,000 per month. If this is fortnightly, you can do it fortnight. Then if it is weekly, you can do weekly payments as well. It can also be monthly, quarterly, twice a year, or annual payments. Let's say for us, this is a one-time payment for now. And below that, I can add a description. Descriptions help in ensuring that the person that is on the other end of the link that is going to be receiving the link has an idea of what they are paying for. Below that, you can also upload an image. Usually, the image is going to be a picture of your invoice or your contractual agreement. So you can click on upload image over here and upload a image of your invoice or of your contract. Below that, you can add a custom field. So you can add things such as maybe uh, signed off by or delivery details or any other information. Then you can include tips if you want. Then you have confirmation. So if you want to redirect to a website after checkout and you can display your own website after your checkout, but I don't wanna do that. I just want a simple link. This is what the overall appearance looks like, like so. And once I've done that, I'm going to click on save on the top right. And once I have clicked on save, I can click on preview over here to see what my payment link looks like. So this is currently what my payment links looks like. I haven't activated my Square account, so it's not going to be able to accept payments. You do have to verify your identity with Square to be able to accept payments. And the best part about using Square is that not only can you create this simple payment link for any type of payment, let's say I have payment links, and you guys can see we have our first link that has been created over here. Now, not only can we create this as a link, but we can also send this as a message. We can even create a QR code for the link, and we can even create a buy button with this link. So all of these features help you in improving the overall health of your business with different variations of payments available. So if you're creating menus or if you're creating a simpler payment option, so if you are providing one service only and the payment for that service is going to be the same for everyone, you can just include a QR code within your office or within your website so people can easily scan and pay as they go. Including a direct buy button can help you in checkout from a landing page if you're promoting this product or service on a landing page and sending it out as a direct message can make it easier for you to send out mail and to send it to the relevant person. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and you are now able to create payment links with Square. If you did find this video helpful, make sure to leave a like and subscribe to our YouTube channel. And if you have any questions or queries, leave those in the comment box down below. I would love to know what you guys have to say.